I'm trying to build a business around the creative things that I do in my own practice. I was sort of separated all over the place and I had the idea to just concentrate, just to bring everything together, create my own little business that could sustain me and my family, doing the creative things that I enjoy doing for, for artists. Being part of the art community, you've got lots of friends that want these things and you get word of mouth, so you make someone a piece of furniture or make someone a frame and they tell their friends. And The first 12 months is to build a reputation, uh, develop kind of, you know, you need to develop processes, you need to fine tune the workshop, you need to set up, you know, your account, you know, those things. The first 12 months are just making sure all the basics are done well. I mean, things like materials, you know, locating good local materials, sustainable materials, things like that, things that I'm interested in doing, you know, that has to, that's legwork that has to be done. I think the worst part is kind of that fear that you you know you might not have any money there have been weeks where you've had like 10 pounds in your pocket to last the week and you don't know how you're going to feed the kit you know you have you have those real black moments you make one product and it pays for something else you know so everything at the moment is just kind of just scraping through but it's it exists you know i've made it i've got a business plan i'm just going through the finances uh I've got a sort of website that's sort of just early stages. My trusty old van that I've had for 10 years has died a death, sadly. So because I don't have a retail unit and it's just web-based and, you, you know, the sort of materials that I use, I need that form of transport. So that's kind of been a big stumbling block. The way people want, want this, you know, when you talk to people about it, they, you know, they want you to do it. And it's, it's that kind of encouragement really that sort of makes me want to really at least have it at least have one proper go at doing it just invigilating at the, the show today just hopefully someone will turn up and come and have a look venture out into the cold a couple of workshops so i'm just about to sharpen a pencil as an artist you're kind of a small business aren't you you have to do everything organize your materials you've got to plan your work your day's work you've got to advertise set up your web platform you've got to have you know you've got to kind of create your own story you've got to have you know your little your blurb and so you've got to be a writer you've got to be a publicist you've got to be as well as just being a painter i think that's where a lot of us fall down is that lack of realization of how important it is and i'm guilty because i know it's important and i could do these things but i just <laughs> don't do these things i've got a facebook page that's all i've got